Well, a Shreveport woman is sharing her experience after bullets rained down on her home last New Year's Eve. That's our top story this morning. As we prepare to ring in the New Year, Shreveport police want to remind everyone about the dangers of celebrating with gunfire. NBC 6's Maya Nicholson shares the details. Many communities nationwide have seen the negative impacts of people shooting guns and firearms in the air in place of fireworks, also known as celebratory gunfire. We are notorious for celebratory gunfire on New Year's Eve night. The Shreveport Police Department wants people to stop. What goes up must come down, and it comes down at a rate that we see every year travel through roofs and uh, all the way from the roof, interior portion of the ceiling, down through the floor, and even into automobiles. So it, it can cause property damage, but the worst possible scenario would be the loss of human life. It came from way back there somewhere, you know. I, we don't know where. All we know, it came. A woman from Shreveport shared her story of surviving a stray bullet that went through her roof on New Year's recently. When we walked back there, we went. And all I could do is thank God, because I could have easily, I, I think I had just went in the house and came back out. Police also say it is illegal to discharge BB guns in place of fireworks. If there are BB guns out there that shoot at the velocity of a 22 caliber rifle, so they can kill you. There are BB guns or pellet guns that can cause serious bodily injury or death should they be discharged and hit someone, especially in close proximity. Violations of these laws in Shreveport may result in a fine. Since being a police officer, I've, I've worked calls the next day. People's cars have bullet holes in them, uh, houses, windows, uh, just from the celebratory gunfire. Maya Nicholson, NBC6 News.